hey guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl taylor lachelle back at it again with another video today's video is going to be a straight to curly hair routine in shower hair routine y'all i'm looking super dusty super crusty i got crust in my eyes my eyebrows are crusty everything about me is crusty so we're just going to get right together and i'm going to show you guys how i do my shower routine so first, I'm going to start by washing my hair um, using the apple cider vinegar shampoo. I don't know what it is, but for some reason, apple cider vinegar products work really good with my hair and my porosity. So yeah, it's just a really good shampoo. Also, it's like a clarifying shampoo. My hair has been straight with a lot of product buildup for about two weeks now. So definitely that shampoo did its job. So I like to wash my hair twice with the shampoo and then I like to go in with a more gentle shampoo, um, more so geared towards hair growth. So I like to use the Shea Moisture um, Jamaican Black Castor Oil Strengthen and Restore Shampoo. Strictly um, going on my scalp and just running it all throughout my hair. And I don't know what it is about that shampoo, but it just makes my hair so soft. My hair feels so hydrated. I don't know. It just, it feels like it coats my hair with magic. So... <laughs> going to use this hair treatment mask so I've never used this I just got it but apparently it's a self-heating deep treatment mask feels really good has nice slip a really great detangler very hydrating but I did not see or feel any steam any heat none of that so the heating part I'm not really sure about I'm not really sure if I had to put on a plastic cap or what I had to do but it definitely did not heat my hair or my scalp, but very conditioning. I just finished my shower routine and then after that's all said and done, I rinse out the mask and I just pin my hair up. So now this is my hair. Um, it's pretty damp very frizzy and dry. So now I'm gonna go in with the spray. This is for dry hair and scalp relief. Um, again, I've never used this, but I'm gonna try it out. I have really dry, itchy scalp, also dry hair. So, so I'm just gonna spray this all over my hair and scalp. Honestly, this product worked really good for my hair just um, by the first time using it. I really noticed a difference on my scalp and also my hair. And it smells really good. So now I'm just going in with my typical curly hair routine. My typical curly hair routine products. So if you want to see more about 
what I use on a typical wash and go. You can go watch any of my curly hair videos. They will be linked in the description box or somewhere on the screen. But I'm just going in with a few products from Curl Smith and also a product from Not Your Mother's. So I just write that all throughout my hair and then I detangle for the very last time. And just FYI guys, I do not use a dimming brush to detangle my hair. I know that was a comment on one of my old videos. Um, Y'all, I'm not that crazy, okay? I don't use a dimming brush to detangle my hair. My hair is too thick and too tangly and too frizzy to be doing all that. I use a wet brush. Um, there's actually three different wet brushes that I use made specifically for curly hair when it's wet. I went in with my wet brush, um, my wet paddle brush this time to detangle my hair. Now I'm just going in with finishing products to just help my hair curl because it's been a little lazy and dry and just all that. And this is after hours and hours and hours of letting my hair dry. So this is how my hair turned out. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, and turn on that bell to get notified every time I post a video. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.